<laughs> Greetings, friend. We're getting right back into our hardcore playthrough. Okay, yes, comforts here. Let's continue it. All right, we're in Sierzo. We're going after Vandevel Fortress. They've threatened the village and all its inhabitants. That can't be st that can't be uh, accepted. You know what I like to do with these people? Deal with them. One of the terms I've always been using. Got to deal with it. So let's deal with these guys. We got three warlords to defeat. We've got instruction from Burak. So, let's make our way through Sierra's storage. Let's get our lantern going. Take the bread, might as well. Could never hurt to have more bread in the bag. Gayberry jam recipe. Why do I not? Oh, I think the recipe just respawned. Yeah, I already know it. Just drop it. I'm not going to take any of that. I've got a mining pick right here. Let's see what my mining pick looks like. It's fresh. Not going to worry about it. I've got this cold that's uh, now receding because I've taken soothing tea for it. Okay. Got to brush up on some attack skills. Feels like it's been a while since I played the game. I'm gonna be honest. Okay, I'm gonna be real honest about it. Okay. I took the trident. That was a complete accident. I honestly don't care to have it. There's some. There's some iron over here though that I I want to mine because there's the chance for the gem. Medium ruby. Nope. I usually try to speak it into existence. Sometimes I feel it works. Got a green mushroom, common mushroom here that I feel needs to be grabbed. Okay, it doesn't really need to be grabbed, I just like to. Ochre spice beetle. It's one benefit from harvesting. And it's a great benefit. Ochre spice beetle. Exit out to the chairs and ease. I'm excited to get back into this. Um, like I said, it's been a bit. It's been a bit. But I appreciate you guys watching. Um, gotten a lot of positive feedback from you guys, so I, I thank you. It's been fun. All right. Gather some seaweed. Got the snow in the chair's knees. Night's falling as well. Uh, let's go ahead and take a warm potion. So that, that'll grant me the warm boon and bitter spicy protects against the cold all right now my now my uh, temperature's good it's on the rise gather fish chance to get blue sand which is valuable to sell i just got one salmon that time that's one salmon Again, I've said this before, in real life, I mean, that's great. In Outward, one salmon's kind of the worst thing you can get. Got blue sand right here. Shows up well in the, in the snow. Okay. Mantis shrimp. Let's brush up on some attack skills. Come on, yes. Oh, I got him staggered. Yes, sweep kick, yes. Sit down, please, and leave. Left hand, overhand. Okay. I'm loving that attack. Okay, dry mushroom bars. Gotta get rid of some of that burnt health. And I've gotta get some health restoration going. Nine bread of the wilds. That's a mistake. Okay, my bag is... Eight jerkies, nine bread of the wild. Okay, this is like, this is like when I first started playing Outward. Just the bag stuffed with food. Just completely overweight. Although I'm not overweight, but all the food just kind of rotting whenever I enter into a new region. A giant list goes up on the left side of the screen about all the things that rotted. 
It's classic. It's classic uh, noob outward. So, I'll po I apologize for those of you who are experienced players and are offended by my inventory. Actually, I shouldn't apologize for that. It's fine. I can carry around nine bread of the wilds. And nine jerkies as well. Not smart, but I can do it. Ah. The chairs and knees. Love that sight. Really loving that sight. Sometimes I just want to have the camera on a certain sight. So if I'm going, you know, a different direction than where the camera... I'll just flip the camera around like so. It's a little difficult to see enemies coming, but... It's kind of like an advanced mode of outward. <clears throat> Can't really see what's ahead of you. Alright. Enough of that. Sometimes I forget it's hardcore permadeath. Get too lazy. Blue sand, gather that, yes. I'm probably missing some fishing spots. It's fine. It's not going to be the end of the world. I usually sort of a completionist, but... Okay, another mantis shrimp. Okay, again. I'm going to try to brush up on some combat. Good. Sweet kick. Staggered. Yes, put him on the ground. Yes, thank you. I'm coughing. It's fine because I've got that receding cold. Master Trader gear gives me some cold weather defense. I think. I know it gives me hot weather defense. I th yeah, cold too. Cold as well. Ash Giant's log's been updated? Oh, talk to Rissa. Just let me know if the three days, the three day free period has, has passed. Now I can now I can acquire the Ash Giants quest from Rissa. Quest number two in the Blue Chamber Collective Faction. Amalite with the Gravel Beetle. I'm loving the Gravel Beetle. Always have. Blue sand, good. Okay. Again, my temperature is dropping again. Let's go bitter spicy once again. Might as well, ah, I'll do warm boon. Use some mana. For a second there, I was gonna go bread of the wild. Hmm, anything for mana restoration? I guess I've got the raw turnip. Just consume that. That gives some mana. Rest restorative properties. All right, got this pistol shrimp here. Nice. Sweep kick him. Oh, I'm, I missed him with the sweep kick. Oh, now he's ruining me. Okay, left hand overhand. Okay. Hmm. I feel like the combat... I've got to be better in combat. To go into Vandeville hardcore mode. Gray Pearl Bird. Okay. I feel like I don't want to shy away from him. Hmm. Got Warm Boon. Possessed, cool boon, mist, rage. Let's do it. Let's infuse frost. Um, let's go spiritual varnish. Sorry. I'm scared. I'm gonna be honest. Yes. 
Come on. Oh. Hmm. Really scary. He inflicted pain. Got him with that sweet kick that staggered him. Oh boy. Got intense right there for a second. Pearl Bird Cutthroat. Some of the best loot in the game. Some of the best organic loot. Okay, we're talking beetles, mushrooms, that sort of thing. You're not going to find a, you know, brutal great axe inside of a Pearl Bird Cutthroat. It's all organic. Okay, good. We got some health restoration going. I thought those Strog statues were some sort of weird enemy I've never seen. But again, it's been it's been a little while since I played. I'm not making excuses. Okay? No excuses. I should be brushed up on my combat. I should be brushed up on all this. This guy's gonna pay. Boom, leave. Um, I'll just eat the jerky. I have too many pieces of jerky in my bag. Let's just roll over that health restoration. I'm still a little bit shaky from the Pearlbird Cutthroat battle. Okay, my hands are a little bit trembly. I thought that was a rich iron ore. Yeah. Thank you. Uh-oh. I'm cold. Let the temperature get away from me. I didn't even really see that going on. And I've warm booned up. As well as bitter spicy tea and it's not helping me. So that's a bit of an issue. It's because it's the dead of night. In the dead of night, you're going to have problems staying, staying warm. Unless you're decked out in warm clothing. Or, or you've got some weather tolerance skills. The Cabal of Wind Hermit, he teaches a weather, weather tolerance that I want to learn. I think on, on this trip in the Chair's Knees, I'll try to get over there and learn that. Got those two bandits over there that I want to dismantle them. Why would I let them run roam free? A pearl bird? Okay. Again. Should I even say it? The mask. It's really what I want. Warm potion recipe. Good. Read that. Again, I'm not crafting any anything that I haven't learned, that my character hasn't learned. Although I know the warm potion recipes, thick oil and water. Is that what it is? Thick oil and water, yeah. I don't want to... Hmm. Yeah, sweet kick. Sit down. Yeah, thick oil and water, warm pushing recipe. I'm, I'm not gonna, you know, use it. I'm not gonna make it until I my character actually learns it. So now I've learned it. Dry mushroom bar, good. That's that pearl bird that I've dealt with. Hmm. Got a rich iron ore up here. 
trying to think about what to do about the temperature. Got my weather defense potion. I kind of want to save it. Um, got some things I can craft here. Some elemental rags, might as well. Um, let's see. Bandage, stack some health regen. Hmm. Let's just drop the iron s scraps. Keep the bag nice and fresh. The time is uh, it's almost 1 a.m. So it's not going to heat up anytime soon. I guess I'll just um, get into Vandeville. Sweep kick. Come on. That sweet kick's really, really working wonders. Travel ration, I guess. Only problem with rations is they're a bit heavy. I'm just gonna run at this dude. Completely missed him. Sweepy. Wow, recovering from that sweepy. Leave. Took the machete on accident. It's classic. How are my knuckles? Knuckles are badly damaged. Well, yeah, pretty much. Let's get into Vandeville. Can we sleep in Vandeville? Just kind of sleep right next to Croc. I'm gonna try it. Hmm. I'll sleep right on his rug. Probably shouldn't be able to, but it seems like it's letting me. Ninety percent ambush. I'm gonna see what that does. I'm gonna go ahead and get ambushed. Repair for five. I don't know how the ambush is going to work. Sometimes... Okay. Fortunately, your rest goes without incident. You feel better prepared for the day. So, 90% ambush, didn't get ambushed. Sometimes it'll say, you did get ambushed. You'll wake up and it'll just be like this. This scene right here, no one moving, no one attacking you. Disassemble the bedroll. Let's drink some water. How are the nucks? The nucks are perfect. It's where I want them. Um, okay, it's boon up. Let's get ready to go at croc. What am I going to use? I guess I'll use. Uh, I oh, got discipline? No, I don't. So, I guess I'll go to discipline potion. Don't have the focus skill learned yet. I'll go bolt rag with him. Well, now, what do we have here? Lost, lost traveler. Warm yourself You'll up. Take good care of you. Sorry, sorry. Kind of interrupted him quite a bit. I'm looking for someone to have a drink with. Oh. What do you have for us to drink? I have a bottle of Gayberry wine, actually. All right. Bro, oh, man, that was the best booze I've had in... ever. I feel like I could take on anyone and win. Anyone? Even me? You've earned this. Good. Come on, now. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> Kidding me? Hmm. Okay. Take the bread, bandage up.
eat the mushroom bar, take the keys. I actually don't get this. When you kill Croc, his body vanishes. Brutal club. Bag over weight. His body vanishes. There's like a a purple flame that kind of comes up from this situation here. I mean, what what what's going on there? I've never really figured it out. There's a uh, ornate chest right here from from that ring. If you pull that ring, okay. So I got to start thinking about my bag. Let's go ahead and drink the mist potion, I guess. The bag is overweight. Use a bandage. I'll use it. Eat the termit potage too. Get that mana going back up. Um. Let's see. There's two more warlords to deal with. We've got the uh, the mage up here. Okay, so heading on up. Hmm. Okay, let's go. I already drank the mist potion. Let's drink the other one just to refresh that mist boon. Um, oh, the spiritual varnish. You're not one of my warriors. You're from Sierzo. I know. Yeah, I'm here to kill you, actually. Do not cross me. Mm. Oh. Oh. Chaos. Oh. Scary. Oh. Wow. I'm telling you, my heart skips a beat on this stuff. Don't be deceived. I know some of you think I'm cool, calm, and collected. And I try to be for the most part, but... Outward gets, outward gets at you sometimes. Arcane robe. Hmm. It was sketchy because... As soon as I'm done talking with her, all of a sudden she's behind me. And then she transported in front of me. That was kind of, that was a little bit strange. Okay. Health levels aren't great. In fact, let's go ahead and just take a life potion there. I like the music in these dungeons here. Vandaval. Got a sick bay here. Can you talk to anyone? Alchemy kit. You can make a life potion. Cool. Wow. Lots of life potions. Discipline potions. Nice. Three discipline potions. Okay, pouch over weight. It's from all the life potions. You can actually sell life potions to them. Here's the plan. Oh, you, you know how to make bandages, right? We need medical supplies to patch our men up. Bandages or health potions will do. Pay attention. I made the potion for you. You have my thanks. 
she gives 15 silver. Here's the plan. Made the potion. You have my thanks. Here's the plan. You have my thanks. Here's the plan. You have my thanks. Just giving away all my potions. Here's the plan. You have my thanks. I have too many anyways. Here's the plan. You have my thanks. Okay. That's decent. Whoops. Okay. Hmm. I'm afraid I'm quite busy some other time. Perhaps some other time. Okay. So you're not aware that I've pretty much invaded your, your prison and I'm destroying your leaders. I wonder. Okay. Just so we're clear on that. I understand you, you don't, you're not aware. Oh, this guy sells some things. Is there something you need? Two ingots. Get rid of my, get rid of some of the stuff in my bag. Um. Oh, he doesn't, he doesn't pay me very much. I think he pays me half the price for these. That's okay. That's fine. I'll take less money for those. It's fine to have the bag overweight. I mean, I'd rather have the bag underweight. <clears throat> I don't want to sleep. I want to open looter's corpse. Yeah, there you go. Discipline potion again? Poison rag. I'm not gonna take that. Or the garb. Green mushroom's good. I really can't get enough dry mushroom bars. A bunch of mining picks on the table. Blood mushrooms. It's always good to have a lot early. Life potions. Gotta get my lantern going. Star mushrooms, sure. Hmm, okay. How are my knuckles? My knuckles are totally fine. I know I've only fought a couple guys, but I'm telling you, those fang weapons are very... The fragile or fragile. The durability is not great on them. They'll damage really easily. There's a few different little minor quests that you can do with these guys. I don't know. I don't think I'm going to do them, but there's a shiv dagger situation. Um. Damn can't take this place anymore. I want out. I need out. My shiv's broken. I need a new one. Bring me one. I can show you how to use it. I don't care if you have to make one. I need one. Okay, she gives me, gives me this shiv dagger recipe. Let's learn it. Um... Oh, I can, okay, yeah. Didn't appear, because I think I can make it. There you go. Rag and, rag and iron scrap. Dumb. Here's your shiv, what's your plan? Give me a hand, will you? This is what I need. A promise is a promise. Listen, if you need something from here, if you need something from someone here, Backstabbing someone with one of these isn't too hard. Here, let me show you. Hmm. Oh. Hmm. Now leave me alone. Hmm. I need to escape. Hmm. Backstab's been learned. 30 silver. And there's kind of a tragic end right here. I actually keep it on her. Just watch her. Watch her as I drift away into the next room. All of a sudden, she's on the ground with the shiv dagger through her belly.
I wish they would have given me more dialogue options. Let's try to lift her spirits. Take the jerky. We've got a kitchen in here. More bitter spicy tea for the winter weather. Dry mushroom bar, gay berry jam. Gay berry tartine, yep. More jerky? Oof. No. The salmon's pretty decent for this. Pata Fadu Pirate. Probably, um, probably butching the pronunciation, just full disclosure. Drink the water. One more warlord to deal with. Stamina regen minus 15%. Hmm. Is there something that instantly cures the cold? That's what I need. What does this give me for stamina? Stamina recovery four, yes. Okay. That guard just kind of lets me walk up. Got fangs around my wrists. I'm all just looking like I'm on a rampage to destroy. It's just no questions asked. He just, you know, lets me go up. Okay, so. Elemental resistance. I should have taken that for uh, Belira. Okay, this can get sketchy. This will boon up. I'm going to go Mist, Boon. I'll go Lightning. I don't have Blessed Boon, okay. Again, sometimes I'm forgetting what I've learned. Alright. I'll go Mist, Boon. Could be it. This is a tough fight. Got the warm boon from that. I could do. Can I do discipline potion? Rage. I'll try to get a sweep kick in there. Survivor elixir. I think that gives me some stamina. Maybe I should have gone dark. Hmm. Okay. Pungent paste, eat that. Bread of the wilds, health recovery five. All right. Let's get at him. Who are you? And why do you dare stand before Rospa Akiyuki? I'm here to kill you. Not happening. You think you can mess with Rospa Akiyuki? Then you die. Archers, fill him with arrows until his blood stains the floor. Come on. Yes. Okay. Now oh, I got the archers at me. Come on. Come on now. Mm. Boom. Delt. Talk to Birak and Sierra for a reward. Everyone's been dealt with. Rospa's archers failed him. If they would have been going at me, 
immediately. I was fighting Rosper for a good few seconds before any arrows hit me. Then I got caught right in the back. Ow, oh, that looked like it hurt. It looked like it hurt badly. Alright, so... Looking in good shape. Health restoration 5. Potafodu pirate again. Again with the pronunciation. Okay. Forgive me for that. This room right here, I've always loved it. Oh, it's not a room. It's like a, a the cavern. Just kind of sit and admire it. The Vandevalian ship just sort of docked. How badly I wish I could jump down into there. Go across there. Bright rich attire. I guess I can sell it. Bag over weight. Drop the shiv dagger. Hmm, what can I drop? Ten rations? What am I doing? What am I doing? Even seven is a lot. Nine jerkies, eight breads of the wild. I'm telling you. My first outward playthrough. That's what I should retitle this series. My first outward playthrough. Based on my inventory. Raspa's dead. He deserved it too. Threatening Sierzo. He doesn't like Ido. How can you not like Ido? Drink from the clean water. Okay. Can return to Burak, but I want to go down this way. If we if we do like another. I felt like before I've I've pressed one of these and then ran and made it out. Okay, so if I uh, yeah, nice. You can pull the ring and run away before you fall down the pit. I was wonder if I could do that. I'll fall down anyway though. Cooking pot? I can't remember if I need one of those or not. I think I have a cooking pot already in Sierzo. I think. Mm. Got some trogs down here that uh, I feel like they've actually given me a s bit of a, a fright at one point. Maybe that was like before I was any good at outward, I don't know. Yeah, this, this Trog Knight, he can be kind of devastating. Oh. The uh, sweep kick. I'm telling you, that sweep kick can really work to your advantage. Especially when you're using a weapon like the fists that don't have great impact. I guess I'll just take it all. Four pounds for the Bright Rich Attire. Bright Rich Attire is actually pretty good. Stamina cost minus 10. 
minus 10 percent the uh, trader guard gives me the stamina bonus though which can't beat it i mean sorry not st the pouch bonus sorry stamina bonus you actually can beat it with dancer's gear which is in a class all its own in my opinion and i still want to acquire it i've got dancer's leggings i've got the mask just got to complete the look let's see yeah that went pretty well belira Belira and her minions got my got my blood pumping. That's for sure. Dealt with the gray pearl bird, which I was the cutthroat. Which honestly things could have got really out of hand, especially if he didn't stagger. Let's just say when I when I did that sweep kick, if that didn't stagger him. I think that could have been the end if he wasn't staggered with that sweep kick. Because how many times did he bite me? Once? I think maybe twice. And my health was over halfway gone and flashing. So he deals some crazy damage. Got a couple bandits here that are just gonna feel the uh, gonna feel the fangs to his back right here. Yeah. Oh. Just dodge right. Come on, buddy. Sweet kick. Finish him off. Left hand. That was strange. I kind of jumped on top of that guy's body, I think. Um, yeah, that was kind of fun. I dodged back. I don't know, that was weird. I, I, I'd like to rewatch that again. See what happened there. I kind of dodged back towards the bandit as he was attacking me. All right, temperature's going down. Let's get warm boon going. Bread of the wild. I guess I'll say bread of the wild, even though it's probably going to end up rotting. All right, see, now that it's daytime, the bitter spicy tea, the bread of the wild's enough to get it done, enough to get the temperature back on the upswing. right now it's just very cold in the dead of night the temperature will read coldest I think coldest yeah. okay let's get back to Virac Pearl Bird there's not going to be a mask. I know there's not. There never is a mask. They've eliminated the mask from the game. The mask is not a thing. It no longer exists. For some reason they got rid of it. Everyone hates the mask, I guess. I thought that would work. Actually, I knew it wouldn't work. But I said it anyways. Hoping that it might. And continue to tell me if you've gotten that mask. That encourages me that it's still out there. I'd like to know it. That's soothing to my soul to know that that Pearl Bird mask is somewhere out there waiting for me. <laughs> the 
chairs at ease. I don't even know why I'm fighting him. Why bother? All this is raw meat and an egg. No! Like, that's the one with the mask. There he is. There goes the mask. I'm actually gonna track that guy down. And that one didn't have it, of course, because this one has it. I feel like I need to sneak. Then I've got to sweet kick him and then deal with him. Because he's going to want to run away from me. Yes. Breaks my heart. Breaks my heart. That they've gotten rid of that mask. I'm gonna write a letter to Nine Dots. Ask why they patched it. Hmm. That'd be kind of funny if I died to hyenas, honestly. It'd be funny, I'd laugh. Come on now. Yes. All right. Temperature's dropping. Got to be aware of this. I think I'm close enough to Sierra's to not worry about it. It's good to endure the, the cold sometimes. It's good to get out there in the cold. Feel the chill on the tip of your nose. Get a little bit of redness around the cheeks. Um, I do like being in cold weather for a while. It does something to the face that's, I think, yeah, that's important. I'm not exactly sure what it does that it's important, but just the feel of it. It makes you feel alive. Maybe for those of you who live in constant cold weather, though, you might hate the cold. Actually, you probably love it since you live there. Um... I've never spent a long period of time in the cold, so I'm speaking as one with no authority on this on the subject. Okay. Again, I'm trying to get the spice beetle from the gay berries. Twelve gay berry tartines. I'm just looking at the quick slot. Again, how many jerkies? This is terrible. This is really bad. Let's get to Burak. Huffing and puffing into town. I've already harvested the gayberries from that bush. Okay. Entered in. Ah. Is Need he something? Greetings, comforts. How are you? Uh, thanks. My men tell me the Vandevelle has gotten a lot quieter. I don't want to think about the disaster that would have hit on behalf of all Sierzo. I thank you. Yes, this is cool. He takes off his helmet, he gives me. Now you get to see Birak's face. 
Kind of looks like he's been wearing the helmet maybe most of his life. Kind of like a Darth Vader situation. Return of the Jedi. Um, kind of pale face, redness around the eyes. Greetings, friend. All right, so let's get rid of this. I'm not going to wear heavy plate armor. It's going to sell it. Let's empty the bag. Sell recipes I already know. Sell the Amalite. Um, got so many greasy ferns. I want to learn the great life recipe. Okay, let's just confirm that. Let's go over to Helmy. Why is my bag still overweight? 76 pounds. Okay, it's just a bit under. It's just a bit overweight. It's fine. Do you have great life recipe? I don't know if she ever has it. Ice varnish? I already know it. Okay. Hmm. I'll just buy some ingots. Did I get the Sierra Town key? I think he gave it to me, right? Yeah, Sears Town Key. All right. Yeah, here's my little campsite, my village site. Bitter spicy teas, love it, love them. I have way too many Gabriel jams, and the tartines is just much, much too much. Okay. This is all... I've just got to get rid of this food. Is there something you need? Um, no, but I've got a bunch of toast with jam. Spread for people who want it. Please, just take all of it. You don't even have to pay me silver. I'll sell all the blue sand. Whoops. Sell the jewels. I guess I got warm potion. Okay, astro potion. More life potions. It's overweight because the giant amount of life potions. Is there something you need? Well, not really. There's some, yeah, just give you some of those warm potions. Um. Can I buy elemental discharge? I think I can. Can I help you? Yeah, Rago, you can give me some silver. Let's go over to Edo. Amber, my friend. Amber. Yeah, elements of discharge, nice. Side to the quick slot there. R? How does that feel? R. Yeah, it feels good. Gotta have your quick slots assigned in such a way where your fingers are. Um, where it's comfortable, you know, for your fingers. Certain certain keys are are easier to hit when you're nervous and panicking during combat. Yeah, 
We've got Sears or Town Key. Now I can get down here to the se into the storage area of the city hall. Ornate chest. It's usually not that great of a chest. And yeah, not that great. Not bad, not bad. I don't want to be, you know, accused of complaining, so. Now, this chest over here, is there? Oh, no. It remains permanently empty after you loot it the first time. Similar to all the junk piles, I guess. Um... Yeah, we'll sleep in Sierzo. Sleep in Sierzo while I'm here. Visit the old lighthouse. Good to go back home. You know? Every once in a while, pay a visit to the old lighthouse. What do I have in the stash? Five fire rags? Okay. All right. What time we got? It's midnight. It's 11:30. 12:30, 1:32, 33, 34, 35, 30. 5:30 in the morning. Good wake up time. It's good wake up time when you're got a day of adventure planned. That wasn't enough for the knuckles, though. It's fine. Just go with it. Got the brutal axe, I can sell that. So now we've got Ash Giant's quest is ready. Ready for us to go receive from Rissa. Is there something you need? Again, Doran, there's something you need. I know. You want me to buy you want me to buy something? Here. Okay. I'll just buy one of your lanterns to make you feel better. Just kinda go around the corner. Just kinda drop it. Um yeah. That kind of seems like I wanted to start a fire, which I didn't. I, I was didn't want it to light. Like I don't want it to be lit on the ground. What could I do for you? All right. What kind of recipes? Just fang, some fang weapons. Okay. Fishmonger Carl. Sometimes I forget if he... Greetings, friend. <laughs> Greetings. <laughs> yeah, yeah, no. He doesn't sell recipes or anything. Just... But it's worth it to talk to him to get the greetings. The most cheerful greetings in the game. Cutthroat. I fought your cousin yesterday. It was nasty, it was nasty. He almost put me to the ground. All right, right now I want to do um, Ghost Pass. I think it'd be a fun one to do. I think uh, yeah, I want to get to the Cabal of Wind Hermit, get that skill, weather tolerance, mana push as well. I'm a fan of that. All right, let's go ahead and do it. Let's make our way over there. At this point, my recording software glitched. My audio cut out on me. Luckily, I was just getting ready to end the session. So all I'm doing right here is getting that warm boon going. I'm drinking a bitter spicy tea. Protect against that cold weather. So, getting that temperature back up on the rise. And then I proceed to close it out. And that was pretty much it. So, thank you guys for watching. We'll see you on the next one. Well, bye.